What is some of the craziest DMs? Oh, we're straight into it. We're going to go straight, straight into, into it. it. We're going to go straight into it. What are some of the craziest DMs you guys have ever gotten as a woman? Because, come on. You women got like that. So we're going to be like, I want to, I want your bath water or something like that. <laughs> Actually, like any app you can think of, I've probably had been slid on. Like, I think even Facebook Marketplace, this guy <gasps> slid. I was trying to sell shoes and this guy goes, if you wear them for a few days, can I pay more for it? Oh. And I'm just like, I just want to sell my shoes. <laughs> Do you want them? No. You should have just you should have just like said all right and just like sold to him five days later, and not even worn them. I didn't. I didn't think I'm too nice. I, I was too what? ghost. Out. I was too ghost out. Girl, you trying to get the bag? Wait, you responded. Out. I wouldn't have. Responded. No, I didn't respond. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, I was you just did, like, you did it or you did? I, no, I was too ghost out, so I just left it. Bro, oh. what? Yeah, that's why. That's a come up right now. <laughs> so it's not. It's, that was Facebook Marketplace. Yeah. What kind of shoes were they? Just like my old like ballet shoes. Ballet, ballet, like ballet shoes? flat shoes for oh, like work wow. and stuff. Wait, you, oh. they're called like ballet shoes, yeah, 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 like, oh. for like, like flats okay, for okay. work. Yeah. Okay. 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 You can. You could. You know ballet. Like you know the. Whole Not thing. that ballet. Like going to work type of shoes. Oh. Like flat shoes. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Like flat yeah. dressy shoes. I thought. My I thought. Bad. I thought you meant no. like ballet. Like, like doing like legit did the ballet no. like the whole. No, 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 she's no. plieing across the, <laughs> the work floor like no, this. It's blood, blood, sweat, and tears in those. Yep. What about you, Juliana? Okay, so mine have only ever been like, I feel like Instagram and I think like on the dating apps and stuff too, but I always screenshot them because I send them to my like best friends and they're just like, so I have them like I favored, I went back and favorited them and I just have like some crazy (laughs) ones, but I remember one now. most Most of them are like your... Like the same thing, like, you know, like the sugar baby situation, like that's normal, right? Like a lot of people get that. No, what's that? What, what do you mean? Explain that. Oh, oh, sugar well, like, daddy. yeah, yeah. When they're like, um, I'd like you to be my sugar, ba- sugar baby, just letting you know my intention in case you will be interested. They just like, you know, they're like, oh, do you need a sugar daddy? But mostly mm. those are like bots and stuff. So like, you know, females like always get those. But I've gotten some really like crazy ones, I feel like. And um, I just pulled up two that were just sugar daddies. But this one wasn't a DM. It was like a comment on a f- on a picture. Um, it was like one of the pictures when we went to Vegas all together last year. So it was like even like just a group of people. But I'm going to read it to you because it's funny. Um, I would I want to read the username because that probably isn't a real person and it's such a weird username. Do you want okay. me to read the username? Okay. Okay, the user the username is bad mr frosty 85. He goes and actually this is kind of weird but I guess he was trying to be flattering. But he goes, "You're so hot, you could melt the homes of polar bears." But I know you wouldn't do that. And even if you did, the polar bears would understand. <laughs> that last part was not true. They'd be really pissed, and you do not want to piss off a polar bear. They would eat you, so stay away from polar bear homes. <laughs> I was like, is this real? Like, it was kind of fitting because Mr. Frosty and talking about polar bears, but um, <laughs> I had to screenshot it, and I like, immediately sent it like to you know my best friends because we laugh about shit that y'all do, men. That is that is funny. I get like wild, like just across the board, wild ones, stuff like like cliche stuff like that. I think the one I got was I was tagged on a story of a selfie of this guy shirtless, and then you, I, t- I showed you it. You, and then it was the eggplant emoji placed strategically, and it had my name tagged. And it was like I don't know this guy, and he just like a random follower. And then I think you were tagged too for some reason because I guess it pops up with like. If he follows me and then it'll pop up other girl like suggested girls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause you got tagged too, and then you saw it and then you showed it to me. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think I remember this. Cause yeah, I was yeah. like, who the hell is this? And same, I was like, in the God. same message or separate? Separate, like separate story. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. He was like posting a bunch of girls. He was wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one was weird. Is he real is he a real guy? I don't know. I don't, maybe just a creepy. Oh, I got another one. It's very interesting. <laughs> it's very I got interesting. another one. This one was recent, last year, 2021. Hey, not to be creepy, just being honest. Damn, girl, your ass is so fat. Oh, my God, I'm in love with your booty. You should not be single. But don't worry, I'm not trying to ask you out. 
I'm just speaking the truth, and it sets me free. Your booty is so beautiful. You are a fine person inside and out. Okay, that's all. Have a blessed day. I'm sure God loves you. I'm like, oh. I, he had to put a little God in the Thank end. Thank you, Lord. Bless you. Thank you. And the, the funniest, though, are the ones, like, from, like, the dating apps that, like, keep sending, like, the message over and over. Like, I don't even know how this person... Even you, match, ma- you match them? No, though. I don't no? think so. Like, I or mean, maybe I did. I don't know. But you know, back then I used that means to. You match. No, back <laughs> then I used to Tinder roulette and just like keep swiping oh. and like. Oh, you, oh, know, wait, you actually did that? Like, just just. Keep oh going. yeah, I mean, I just swipe and you don't have to like respond. I did that a lot on Bumble too, but you just like swipe and then you know you get a bunch of matches, but like you don't have to like respond to them. Dude, when we first got out of college, someone that we know, I'm not going to say his name, he's going to beat my ass if I said his name. When we were in new cities, we did that as like a joke. And then it would, like when you go to a new city, they would do it. And like, it was never good. It was never good. It was only on Tinder too because all the other apps, you're just like, nah. But Tinder is just like a free for all. There's like, yeah. I mean, that's like the OG of dating apps. This is different people on Tinder. But I feel like the dating apps are like the best in like other cities. Like yes. where you're not from. Yes. I feel that way. Yes. Because I mean, like I have a hinge and I had like Bumble and Tinder and stuff, but I never use them here mm-hmm. because. What do you have your location set ew. to? Oh, 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 oh my God. Okay. So last year after I came back from LA, I left it there for like three months uh-huh. and like I kept matching with people and like they were like, oh, like, you know, where do you live? I'm like, oh, you know, funny story. <laughs> I don't live there. <laughs> and it would just be so weird. And I would just be like, it would be like three months passed so then i would just be like oh you know like i i forgot to change my location you know and they'll be like oh okay that's kind of weird and then like eventually it'll just stop but out of town um matches are probably the best you didn't meet no cool people while you were matched up in la that were like oh maybe i'll fly out again link up with them or something you never thought about that i met somebody yeah I met someone. so you so you, you got to match them. You were like, oh, this, this guy's this guy's cute. I'm no, a, yeah. I'll fly well, out. So Christian Damn. knows, but I'm, I matched with someone. And then um, like when I was out there last year and then I met him in May um, in Atlanta, but it's dead and gone now. Mm-hmm. Right? Is it? It is. Really? Yeah, it is. Wait, I have a question. So what? he's from L.A. He just y'all just met in Atlanta. Yeah, 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 yeah. He had something for work. So I just like met him out there. Work. No, he had work. No, I'm kidding. I didn't have work. Put in that work. Mm. It was Memorial Day. It's more convenient to go on the East Coast. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, when he was there, you like, you don't gotta go to work, work, work. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. So when when uh when you guys are like matching, and you guys are just chatting. Do you tell him straight up that like, oh, I'm not. You, do you? That- oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, I'm no liar. I I tell the truth. Like, so I just like I would just say like, you know, I live here, and then like I just like didn't change my location back. Because I didn't, but I didn't. It's not that I forgot. I, I didn't, didn't know you can change to. your location. On Hinge, I thought the only yeah, time on was like COVID. Because no, I was, I was checking can. around. And like, now like Tinder and Bumble and stuff, you can too. Oh, wait, really? Yeah. Wait, I thought it was like wait. a paid feature. No, wait, are you on all the social dating apps? No, I used to be on Tinder and Bumble. And then um, I like deleted those because, you know, I feel like Hinge is... Tinder's for the streets. It's not the best. T- Tinder's terrible. Yeah, for I, the streets. I, sure. I, I used that shit since I was like 21, 22. That is bad. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's like the OG, right? Yeah. So it's just like the easiest. I feel like it's the most like user-friendly. They got dating apps for teenagers now. Oh, God. <laughs> this shit's gross. They legit have a dating app for everything. So which one is the one that you use now? Um, I mean, I have Hinge, but I had the uh, profile paused for like a really long time. Oh, is it the quality oh, of guys on Hinge that... That is more appealing versus the other ones. What's the difference? I have I have an opinion on Hinge. Oh, you do? You okay, first. I would love to hear it. Um, versus, so I just feel like Tinder is like back then it was like what's what Jay was saying. Like it's just like so for the streets. Like it's definitely hookup culture, right? But I mean, there has been so many like success stories with it from when it first began. Because like the the purpose of it was a dating app. Ultimately, it was the culture of you know sick horny people that you know made it you know (laughs) made tinder be you know looked at for the streets but um like why i kept hinge versus like tinder and bumble well i removed tinder because of like the culture behind it and it's just like i feel like i swipe through every 
person in this area and I just like wasn't having it anymore. And then um, Bumble I deleted because like I ain't messaging you first. Period. <laughs> and Why? then um, Why not? What, what if he's so it's hard coming okay, up with stuff? If he's like really, really, really like catching my eyes, then yes, but have you ever, we didn't get to that level. You know, all you have to do to a guy on Bumble is literally say hi and I they're going to respond. You know, some That's dating how bad profiles it was. I didn't will say literally hi. put a disclaimer saying if a girl just says hi, we're unmatching. This really? fine. Yeah. Just keep I've moving. seen guys that put that disclaimer. Oh, I've on seen that profile. too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, wait, yeah. Have, wait, do you, so you never ever initiate on Bumble either? I think I would say something like hi, like oh, or like talk, like use their picture and like talk about something like oh, like creative the travel. Like I try to keep it like creative. Okay, so because knowing me, I'm gonna say something oh like oh lord, girl, something. You like, say something. So, you say, so if he's cute enough, you will say something. 